So this one now, we need we need to settle down, get our line of thoughts correctly. Okay. So duplicate Ububa. Are we? Yes. That means if we get more than two same items for the for the list, we go move on. Right? Yes. Good. So now I'm thinking, you may say most of we get this array now. Why use numbers? Since numbers they shorter. So, which we go do? The team go check for these two. You go pick these two. You go come check these two. Is it the same with this one? No. no. Is it the same with this one? No. no. Is it the same with this one? No. No. Is it the same with this one? 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 Yes. You understand? So, or wait till they feel. Eh? Yeah. We go take this one first. Put them inside new array. Mose here will name and duplicate. Right? Mose do dupe array. Yeah. Duplicate array. So we go first take this first element. Then we will get another one. Maybe const. Then this one now will come be the array. So we go pick this first element. We go bring her into this array. Then next, we go come check whether this element, right? Mm. You you grab. We come check this next element whether it did the same with this one. If we say no, they the same. We go bring them in. Then we go check next if this array did the same as this or it did the same as this. If you know they the same, you go bring them in. Go check if this array did the same as this thing. If you know they the same, you go bring them in. Go check if this array did the same with all these ones. If you know they the same, you go bring them in. You go check whether this array, right? You did the same with this. Now we go find out for you. Say did the same with this. We go ignore them. We go move to this. Do the same thing. You did the same with this. We go ignore them. We go move again. We go bring this one. We go check if you did the same with this. If you did the same, we go ignore them. Yes. You grab. Yes. So how to make it easier? It is very easy. See what we go do. Two. We go bring an in. Now we don't get two arrays. The next one three. We go check. Is three equal to the element inside here? No. No. We'll check. Is five equal to any of the elements inside here? No. No. We'll be five. We'll check. Is four equal to any element inside here? No. no. We'll bring you four. Next, six. Is six inside any of the elements here? No. We'll bring them six. If is five inside any element here? Yeah? Yes, there's five. We go ignore. Next, is three inside any element here? Yeah? Yes, there's three. We go ignore. Is two inside any element here? Yeah? Yes, there's two. We go ignore. You grab? Yes. Then see what we go come get here. You grab? Yes. So now, what do we do, right? Because you okay, well, they get different things where they think of, different ways, different things where they think of. You grab one, huh? mm. you they you they get it. Yes, you they list out the concept now. Yes, I understand. Mm -hmm. That's what the output will do. Okay. okay. So now we can use for loop runner. Mm. You understand? Okay. We feel use for loop runner. And again, <laughs> we feel at the reason say we feel combine more than one array method to achieve the same thing. Okay. You they get me? Yes. So now what we go do? We go get our array. This one. 
Yeah, right? Yeah. Then we go to see from this one now. I don't know for where we say I no go hard cool down. You you grab. Okay. So we we'll say first array. Is equal to we go create empty array. Abi, you grab. Yes. Then we can say array. Array dot what push. Abi. Yes. And then we go bring in this one, the first element of this one, this array. You know, say an empty array be this. Yes, that's an empty array. This one will be the original copy. That's non duplicate copy. Oh, yes, non duplicate array. Abi? Yeah. So now I go bring in this first element into this array. Now, which I just do be this. Okay. The name of the array, non duplicate array. Abi? So okay. yes. I push in the first element here, which is two. So if we print, sorry, if we also dot log non. Do array, Abi? Where do we yes. get? Where do we get? Two. Two. So now, what we will do? We will come check. We will say. Because I don't know. Do, right? Array dot for each for each of the elements inside this duplicate array, Abi. More name yeah. and isn't it? Abi, Abi, yes. So now, more say for each of the elements inside this array, if maybe wake up, wake up, stop it, stop it. That they will not compete. Okay, then more say. No, 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 if she is on the they, they return true or false now. if this dot include okay we go say if do, it does not include right yes. yes if it does not include then we go also say non do are so push and Abi? so here now print no my music make us see if it work okay then if it work then I will come we will go through the whole process again yeah. So, we could check. Error. They say this. Okay. So, if that's the case, if it's equal to false, we're going to throw or false in the return. So, we could see. Now, you, you work, Abby, no work. It worked. It worked. <laughs> so, why did they want? Why did it tweak? Good, good. Make I come over and again. I say we will create an empty array, right? Yes. This one are the main array, the duplicated yes. array. Then we will create an empty array. You understand? Now this empty array, what we will go first do? We will compare this one and this one. Now the first elements where they this main array, we will bring and come because. This is the first element coming into the array. So, of course, we're not going to expect, say, it is duplicated. Yes, yes. Then, subsequently, what we're going to do, we're going to begin check whether 
the array is where, where the next array they equal to waiting done did there before. So now we go check this three, which is the next one. Is it equal to two? If it's not equal to two, write it down. Now, next, we go check this five. This five now, is it equal to two? No. Is it equal to three? No. We go write and down. Next, this four. Is it equal to two? No. Is it equal to three? No. Is it equal to five? No. We go write and down. This six. Is it equal to two? No. Is it equal to three? No. Is it equal to five? No. Is it equal to four? No. We go write and down. This next five. This five. Is it equal to two? No. Is it equal to three? No. Is it equal to five? Yes. We go write down. This three. Is it equal to two? No. Is it equal to three? Yes. We no go write and down. This two. Is it equal to two? Yes. We no go write and down. So now we go come return this array. Okay. Do they get the flow of thoughts where I've been used? Okay. Okay. Yes. Yes. I understand. Yes. Good. So now say the duplicate array. First of all, I first create my empty array. Well, you remember we so my empty array now. We need feed them with this first value of this duplicate array. So which was what I did here. By saying non duplicate array dot push. I can push the first element of this array. That's one at index zero into this array. Now why is it say here I print them out to be sure say it will work. Uh -huh. That's why I can dot log here. So here, what I can do? I can say okay, this for each method. What did they do? They say they assess all the value of this one individually and work on them. You grab. So I can say okay, this duplicate array dot for each of the element where they inside. What I want to make you do? Okay, see what I want to make you do. Make you come check if this element, if it they include them inside this non-duplicate array. Now why I say non-duplicate array dot include n. Okay, if you check this array dot for each first one, you check two. You can come say, you can say if this one dot include two. Two there inside here. Yes, two there inside here. I don't push two already. You understand? But from, but from this method, from this one, eh, you can you eliminate this. You go still work. Ma show you. You work or you no work? You work. Because man, this is an empty array. So first one you go check for two, right? Is two included inside of this array? No, there's no two inside. The array is empty. So it means say you go return as false. So once you return as false, what you go do? Make you push them to go the array for me. So you go push two, enter the array. The next one, because the for each must check all elements. Next, you go come check three. You go check. Okay, three is three included inside this non-duplicate array. Of course, not only two day there now. Three no day. You go all return the false. So from there now, from here, you go push and enter this new array. In fact, this equal to false. Say, I don't know why the team no green. This supposed to work. I don't know why no green work. But it's supposed to work. Good. Uh -huh. So this is the same thing I say. If I say for programming that, eh? if I say, um, if n is equal to nine, right? Like if I this one, if I say like this, if like this, what are they trying to? If n is not equal to five, nine be this one. You understand? Okay. You understand? This negative, you know, neg you know, logical now, logical or. You know, say this one, not not not. Okay, it can actually come 
before any value. Good. So coming before any value, it means it's not that value. So this one, by putting this one here, eh, now the same thing with that one where it's used here. What I say, if it's equal to false. You understand? Yes. But to avoid too much typing, now what I just do one like this. Okay. Okay. So this one, what this one they do is say you can only push the element to this new array if the element know they inside the new array. But so far the elements they inside the new array, you don't go push them. So now we'll check whether this thing will work with string. You know, so we don't check with number if they work. Abi? Yeah. So more we'll check if it will work with string. Right? So we'll run out and see. So what do you see? So you see, say, you know, repeat can. You say, why, why you see, say, lag and Lagos? And because two of them will be the same thing. Like in terms of spelling. Yes. Yeah. But if you check this and this, not the same thing. Lag, lag. So not only one lag show here. You grab. I, I think I understand the concept. With this, with this lines of code now yes can we like put everything inside one block uh, like you know there no be function uh, yeah, give a function okay give a function we we'll go we put everything inside one uh, block yeah. okay now that direction i the try go that the way we we'll put everything for functions yes well, if we want to put this one for function Abi, yeah. what will yeah. we just do? We'll just come. Const. Oh, I say const. Function. Function. Sort. Okay, no, this one will be sort. Duplicate. Abi? Uh, unique. More say unique. Because unique means without duplicate. So, const unique. Here, what you go to take in? You go to take in array. Right? Yeah. Then... What you want me to do? You want me to do everything where they hear. Then here, right? Yes. For this one, we have to change this one name to waiting day here, which is array. Okay. You understand? Because now here would expect where the original array come from. Yes. You understand? Okay. So here, maybe we'll change them to unique unique array you understand so here unique array so here it's two unique array then now what we go do what we go just do here we go print unique ah. unique right now more we'll check we say go take in here now would they call the function you understand would they call the function would they print them out you grab her because see the name of the function unique and it take in array so now for inside the function now they take the array we'll just come copy the array here then put them inside the function then run out let it show undefined, undefined. Come. make i confirm unique right array const array dot for each this uh -huh. make i use uh -huh, man. and you can make i confirm uh -huh. if okay if this unique array dot includes n 
So if it's not there, you need dot array push n. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. This one is for this, right? This one is for this. Uh -huh. This one is for this. Yes. So what's now the problem? Well, I mean, is it you're consoling the slug unique? Okay, okay. You're not passing. Okay. No, see. I know no. they return. I know they return anything. Yeah, yeah. From yeah. the function, I just see them oh. now. Okay. Uh, I know they return anything. So, are you come? So, from here now, after everything here, what I want to do now, now to return unique so, array. So now it should work. You see him? Two, three, five, four, six. You see him? Yeah. Here, because I know they return anything. Yeah, so, yeah. of course, no value is coming from the function. That's why they show not define. Yeah. Uh -huh. So, after all this, I don't finish run operation. Then, give me back my new array. Yeah. So you see everything done inside one block now. Yes. 